the hell was that? Oh my god! Yeah! It all started with a scientific expedition to the planet Turion. Where the New Horizons Corporation was hoping to find new life forms. If only they knew back then what evil they would bring to Earth. A data leak started to spread, revealing that New Horizons was conducting military experiments, crossbreeding the human genome with alien DNA. And so, the nightmare began. Now, competing megacorps all over the world are sending mercenaries to retrieve this research data by all means necessary. That's where we come in. Welcome to level zero extraction. That video just kind of summarized what the game's about. Basically, it's player versus player versus player. Multiple teams of competing mercenaries going into the scientist laboratory where they were crossbreeding horrible human alien monsters together. You have to survive and get out with as much crap as you possibly can before you're killed by many of the other things that want to kill you for numerous reasons. You can play as the mercenaries, you can play as aliens, you can go in as alone, you can go in with buddies. This is a closed beta, so it's gonna be hard to find friends. My friends got it, but he's not here right now, so we're going in alone first. You wanna basically get out of there with as much crap as possible. There's statistics, lore's not in it because it's early beta. There's other stuff. And this little knob gobbler's got so many abilities. Egg trap, place egg traps that will deal damage to humans and temporary give away the- Okay, I thought that was gonna be way crazier. It just gives them away. Like, egg trap, you know? <laughs> thought it was gonna, like, impregnate them, but whatever. We got scream wave, scan wave, EMP, slime spit. So just general awesome alien abilities. Special vision, invisibility, and regeneration. It's just a conglomeration of every famous movie alien mixed into one. It's a Xeno Predator. But the mercenaries got drugs and glow sticks. So basically, it's a pretty fair trade. Oh my god, there's so much stuff. You can trade as well with NPCs, but the NPCs take items you find in the in the games as trade. It's just like scavenging for anything you possibly can. I love this. I love this weapon, the CK-69, but we gotta go get a power drill, two pairs of pliers, and some duct tape. I'd also love to get this flashlight. This is a game changer right here, because the creature, the alien monsters, are so weak to lights. But these ingredients are gonna be damn near impossible if they manage to escape the facility. Drones can be affected by alien EMP and alien spits. That's actually cool. So even if you die, you still have a general purpose in life. I'm bringing some extra flares just in case. You never know how things are gonna be out there. You know, you know, like, wait, these are hand flares, these are glow sticks. So I guess we need flares and glow sticks. We have the axe, we have the weapon with a few freaking bullets put into it. We only have a few actually bolts in this, like starting out, so you don't, you don't have a lot of stuff. This should be good. Like, I don't know. I don't know what we're in for. I have some friends who got the beta though, but they're not on right now. And I just want to see what it's like going into the solo. The solo mercenary survival experience. All right. Into the shizzle we go. I just kissed this photo of my wife and then put it in my helmet. This is pretty Listen cool. Up. You're at the South Pole Research Facility. Take everything that's valuable and find a way out of this hole. Is that Joe Swanson talking? Was that Joe? <laughs> I'm sorry, I got so distracted. Okay, this is our weapon. We have four shots with this weapon. Attention. Terrifying, bro. All power bro. supply system has been switched to emergency mode. This there are 30 so minutes left until emergency power supply cut off. It's like Subnautica structures, but more realistic looking, but also with murder. Oh, sh**. Okay, um... I don't want to already use a flare-up. Is there just literally a light switch in here somewhere? We can't just step into a fully dark room in a game where there's an alien that hunts you in the dark, you know what I mean? Like... <laughs> it's like immediately against my instincts. Here, let's just go this way first. God damn it! Ah! Okay, so we're not gonna go that way. Damn. I think it's so dark. Okay, I'll freaking pop a flare. Maybe that's a standard thing to do. Well, there's a machine gun right there. It should be relatively... Like, the alien can't get past the machine gun. Yo, machine gun! Damn, bro! Okay, wait, you just gotta avoid the laser. I'm surviving machine guns, <laughs> not aliens. <laughs> okay, yeah, activate the light. There's dead bodies all over the place. This one appears to have been dragged over a fair distance from this bed it flipped over. 
I'm investigating. It makes me feel more calm and rational. Ah! 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 Okay, dude, so those things aren't stationary. Thank God they don't pursue though. Okay. Okay. What was that? Attention. Critical overload. Backup power failure. Yeah, watch out for the egg sacs. I don't have the ammo to just be freaking shooting everything I see that disagrees with my fundamental beliefs. Like those egg sacs. Nice. Take the morphine. Yes. That's what we came here for. Drugs. I am on the brink of death like that. Ugh. Backup power restored. You know what? Those turrets actually do make me feel kind of safer as far as the aliens go, because... Yes. Heal me. Heal me, you stupid robot. Because that means the aliens can't just, like, peacefully walk around either. You know what I'm saying? We need low energy. Okay, so that's the battery bar on the bottom left, I see. I was wondering what that was depleting. Oh, that is the scariest opening elevator. All right. I'm staying crouched the whole time. Minimal noise. Okay, so this is what we have so far. Our dextrose solution. We've got a ear thermometer. Everyone back home is probably so lucky we didn't get a butt thermometer. Although, I bet they're actually more accurate. That capsule poison was worth 300 bucks. No! I hear you coming, dude. There it is. Yep, in the elevator. It never even walked by. It just had me in a constant state of terror. Dude, this game looks beautiful. It's such a shame, too, because in the future, everything is going to be as shoddy as all this, because humans are never going to stop being as greedy, so everyone's always going to be cutting costs. And there's, there's, <laughs> there's just always, whoa, this is beautiful. It's hard to find a hallway that's a good piss yellow that's gorgeous, but it's this game did it. I'm impressed. Okay, the laws of video games say we crouch under the steam vent. Nice, we got some pliers. Maybe those are rare in the future. Oh, dude, we're in like the engine's room. Someone always dies in the engine's room. Nice, it's lit up though. Yeah, there's like these. Ah! Attention, critical overload. Backup power failure. Man! <laughs> I just shot myself. Is this open? No. What was that? What was that? What was that? What was that? Oh God! Backup power restored. Man! Freaking diarrhea simulator over here. Who a drill? In a lights? In a freaking welding machine? We're getting a bunch of stuff, so that's awesome. At least I think we are. I have no, like, senses for how valuable any of the stuff is. Okay, this is to the gym. This is where we came from over here. We spawn in the gym. A welding torch. The farther we go in, the better the construction supplies. Oh, sweet dude, stairs. Rich people stairs, too. Makes me feel safer, you know? Space stairs, I suppose. Oh crap, robot's coming! All right, I think there's... The robot voice mentioned something about... That's clearly a mine. And... Oh god! It started counting, <laughs> and there's like the laser down this hallway. Yep, that's why I ran back right there. Whoa, even stepping on broken glass makes broken glass stepping sounds. Monsters can sense you from a distance right now. It's fantastic. I'm so happy I stepped on that gra glass as an example. Just the, the best thing ever. Okay, so now we're going back down the basement instead because I heard some jaws clacking from that direction, which is like the worst sound you could ever hear. I don't even want to move, bro. I don't even want to leave this area. I want to just die here. You know, like, but not from a monster, like from starvation <laughs> over weeks. Okay, we're now going to Sector C. Oh, lovely, a big vent on the floor. What the hell is going on in here? Is this into, like, the, the planets? 
Oh, hell no, bro. Dude, we're on Planet Hoth and there's vents that go right outside perfect. Okay, so we're gonna run to the next area. Who's the Dingleberry who thought this would be hospitable? Oh wait, no, I guess that's not the plot. This would be the perfect place to mix human and alien genome right here for sure. Oh wow, the flare alters your vision so much. Make, it's like horror vision view. <laughs> you can't see very far in front of you anymore. And now everything's all red. Yeah, you can't really see anything with this damn thing. Go, like, stick to the flashlight. It's the only way. All right. Wow, the, the color schemes in these rooms, dude. It's all about that. That future. Ah! Attention. Critical overload. Back to the corner. Backup power failure. Brave moment is gone. <laughs> it's no longer here. Backup power restored. Okay, we have to get past this mine quickly. Oh, nope, the steam vents do hurt you 100%. Everything I said before was true. Oh, God. What the f***? What was that? What was that? What was the point of that? I feel like that was an alien using its sense 100%. That was what that was. There's no doubt in my mind that's what that was. Damn, dude, I don't even know what to do with myself right now. All I know is we've got a bunch of stuff. We've looted a bunch of crap. So like, it's like the whole thing we're doing here. So that's good. Oh no, oh f oh God. Oh, oh, horrible time <laughs> for the battery to run out. Okay, so here's the thing, is I hear feet. Like all around me, I hear feet. Attention, there are 15 minutes left until emergency power supply cut off. I'm not the only one in the vicinity. There's someone else in the vicinity, 100%. Yeah, now I'm double, is he gonna come through this freaking door though? I swear to God, if he comes through this door. What the hell was that? Dude, my bolts and my gun didn't do- I was supposed to have a flare. Light damages the creature, Johnny. <laughs> there was no time to bust out a flare. I thought it was other mercenaries. I was trying to be sneaky. Damn, bro. Damn. Yeah, that was awesome. But this time, I'm going as the alien because it seems so much less scary. We call them dark hunters. <laughs> These creatures are particularly vulnerable to light and use ventilation shafts for movement. Possessing the ability to become invisible, they can move through illuminated areas. Using special vision, they find and consume the eggs of the unborn to gain energy for their superpowers. Their main task is to destroy all living things. Consume eggs of the unborn to gain superpowers. What is this, Hollywood? Oh, this is exciting. Just reminds me of natural selection too, where you're like a creature in the vents, hunting soldiers. This is great though, cause like, unless they're a group, if they're a well-organized group, then it's gonna be difficult. But just people like me playing alone, man. Pure nightmare fuel. Okay, so C is how we trap scanning scream wave. Okay, scream wave is scare humans, causing them to drop item. Scanning scan and find human. Slime spit st stun humans, extinguishing flares. Okay, EMP. Disable nearby electronic. Electronics? I've never even seen that word. Trap. Damn, dude, there's so many things that they didn't have to utilize against me because I was terrified. And then E is how we heal, I think. And then R is how we go. Invisible. I just used it up inappropriately, but I'm trying to learn, like, see what the game's got. Okay, I'm assuming these sparkling plugs on the floor are issues. Turn on the light with his guts poured out on the floor. That's badass. This is this crawling, but we stand up and go humanoid as well. Oh, his hand was so close to the freaking light switch. That's so unfortunate. Okay, we can't use elevators. Oh shit, the, the thing's coming! Oh wait, someone's coming up the elevator right now, I think. So is the machine gun though. Oh my god. I'm trying to ambush these people, but the freaking machine gunner's coming. Well, this is a very intense situation. 
So I can use the elevator. I'm cooking! What the cook me in the elevator? They said, what, 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 they, they said an elevator trap. <laughs> I'm so stupid. That's insane. That's crazy, bro. I've been given new life. Critical overload. There's a person right there. Backup power. But he's failure. hiding from this machine gunner right here. There's a few people in here. Are they able to see me? How invisible are we? I feel like we're pretty invisible. I think I want to just charge these guys down. Dude, I think these guys are as scared as I am right now. He does have a flare aiming out of his face, though. So I have to go up behind him, I assume. Oh my god! So that's what you do. And then we scatter into cover. He's down, so his buddies have to get him. Is your buddy coming back for you? I don't think so. I think I just finished him off as well. So he's either he's gonna be a drone or he's just out of here now. I'm completely just learning this game as I play. So if I do something stupid, I apologize. I'm actually terrified right now still. <laughs> There's so many traps that could be left for me. Okay, well the other one went about this way. Try not to sprint too much so I don't make too much noise, but we still gotta catch. Oh my god, it burns! It freaking burns! Damn, dude. Okay, heal up, little buddy. This game also appears to be lagging a bit at times, but it's it's literally in beta, so it's like it's 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 not a thing, you know, like it's gonna lag a little bit. Oh my god! I'm still living in fear of those turrets and they can't even see me anymore. Oh the freaking turret found me a human! It's a very well lit area though, like that, that is death. What do we do? How do we get him out of there? He's right there hiding in the freaking. oh there's two of them in there! Oh you stinkers! Damn it, how do I pursue them? That's such a- wait- ah! <laughs> Damn it, there was a light switch over there that lit up the whole hallway. Okay, so that's something to watch out for. Just, like, don't loiter around people. Don't, like, hang out around them. Eventually, they're gonna find a light switch, and then the whole room is just death. Damn, that's crazy. Oh, God. Oh, God. Go invisible quick. I don't know what's going on, but just go invisible quick. They're right up there. I'm still basically in the room with them. It's a pretty well-lit room, too. Like, a room that's going to be well-lit. Okay. Did they come from down here? Did they go this way? Or, I mean, did they come from there? What do we do? The elevator There's not a lot of options with leaving this room, except for the big part of the- Okay, you guys maybe just have to wait for a- Yeah, I know what, I know what hurts, I know what hurts. Damn, I was just trying to get under the stairs. It kills me so fast. Okay, so there's no, like, light- <laughs> Like, basically Dracula. There's no, like, I was like, maybe it'll hurt me a little bit while I run past it. Like, no. All right, now we appear to be in some freaky docking room. Every room in this space station is terrifying. Maybe we should just wait for them to give themselves up. Once they make too much noise. It actually is kind of cool that it spawns you relatively close though. So you don't have to spend a bunch of time looking for them. I don't know where they are. Oh, there they are. You can see them when they make noise through the walls. That's so useful. This is what I looked like to the aliens. <laughs> no wonder I was so easy to kill. I imagine once you learn the map, it's going to be like infinitely easier as well too to know your way around. This is really cool. You can open and close vents like this. I couldn't find these vents anywhere the whole time. I realized I was supposed to be opening them. Oh, what's going on over here? Okay, well, I've eaten a... Actually, not that many eggs. I've eaten like four or five eggs. It looks like you want to get a bunch of eggs to unlock all your abilities. So maybe that should literally just be the first main focus. Like the first couple minutes of the game is the alien. You're just going for eggs. Damn it, they're in there. And the freaking lights are on. Damn it, dude. Attention. Oh, the lights have gone off. Backup power they have flares, failure. though. Careful, careful. He's gonna shine that flare at me right when he comes around the corner. Careful. Gotta live in fear of these damn lights, bro. They're just camped back there in the corner. Hello, man. Yeah, they are. They're camped back there in the corner with their freaking lights on. You turns, dude. They're so ready for me. Yeah, they're chasing me with flares. Oh my god. These guys are the real monsters here, not me! 
Yeah, especially with this, like, special vision helping you find eggs super easy. And doing anything else at the start is just silly. I see that now. I'm learning to be a professional alien. Come on, gobble it up. Gobble the eggs. Yes, we've unlocked so many more stuff just now. Gobble more eggs. Nice, nice, nice. Sounds like they're right above me, but I can't go in the freaking elevator. So it's like, we gotta get crafty with it. I feel like they're obviously over here, though, because that's where the lights are turning on. Damn, dude. You turns! I can't go down this hallway now. They block off ways so well. They just know to turn off, like, which hallway when they go into it. Yeah, see, the scan worked pretty well. Or that guy just gave himself up. I don't know. Hide behind the wall. Wait till he turns. Sucker! Get him, Johnny! Don't you dare shine that freaking light on me, bro. Okay, good. He's dead, but I think so are we. My god. Overload. We burst Backup into flames so failing. quickly. Damn, dude, we burst into flames so quickly. I should have used that tool that makes him drop his weapon. I was trying to be stingy with my points. Never be stingy. Wasted no time on the eggs this time, baby. We gotta hurry up and freaking get to where we can scan and find where these goobers are. There's like less and less eggs. No, there's still plenty of eggs. Never mind. Oh, this is like the freaking greenhouse room where vegetation grows freely. This would be where there's a bunch of, eat the damn egg, buddy. Yeah, there's a few in here. Attention. Oh, nice. There are 10 minutes, 10 minutes left, left until emergency power supply cut off. That is the most disturbing freaking countdown voice in the world, by the way. Just slowing it down 15% has turned it terrifying. Okay, that should be all we need. Okay, scan, buddy. This absolutely looks like the room there'd be eggs in. This is like the direct experimental alien room. It's even got like, I don't know. It just looks sketchy. It looks like the room I don't want to be in, dude. There's so many freaking lights in here. Okay, we gotta find these damn humans. Now we're talking into the ceiling, baby. Oh, it's so freaking cold out there, though. Where are they at? I guess we should give it a go just in case. It could have crossed over just as easy. That's so cool you could just jump into those. Give me in there. Yes, there we go. Nice, nice, nice. Alien in the vents, baby. Crap, this map is so big. I'm having so much fun exploring. I'm at full energy. I can't even get more eggs. But where are they, bro? I'm just assuming they revived that guy, so there's still got to be three of them. But we can finish them off. I know what to do now. Oh, there's that's gnarly. That's crazy. Blood on the green screen. The map is so big that until I get a freaking read off on these guys. The elevator in Sector C has been called, it just said. But where the hell is... I don't know Sector C just yet. I'm still new. We're going back. We're going back. Sec this feels too far. We went too far somehow. I just know it. Okay, and now we're at Sector B. So if we just keep moving this way, we'll run into C. Sector C Hall. Oh, the door doesn't open. Ah, you bitch. Find me a vent. Find me a way up. Oh, that's a, that's a heat. Uh, that's just the elevator. That's what that is. Damn, dude. I thought it was a heated vent for a second. It's, it's just light. Okay, up we go. Up ski skis. Okay, so we want to gain altitude in these vents. So we're gonna go where the vents go higher. No! Wait, what? We just won? Oh, because the robot killed the other two. Nice. Well done, robot. The robot gets it, dude. The robot is the homie. We died so many times back there, but we got half the people. I'll take it. We won. All right? <laughs> That's all that matters. We won. Woohoo! I'm the best there ever was. I'm pretty terrible. This is my first time touching the game, okay? We're learning. 